Hi, this is Teddy, your Google Workspace and Gmail strategist. And here's the question. Can I create templates in Google Docs? And how can I use them? I'm going to show you what you can do in this video. But before I do, hit that subscribe and notify button because I create all of this content for you. Google Docs does not have a template function. Now you can get templates, but basically what a template is, is someone sharing their Google Doc, Sheet, Slide, Form, maybe drawing or map, et cetera, et cetera. That's what it is. They're sharing their Google Doc and giving you the ability to see it and then make a copy of it. Example, I create a spreadsheet here. It's a very basic spreadsheet. And so what I could do with this, it would be to share it up here and share. Uh, anyone on the internet link can view it, copy that link, and now anybody with, on the internet can view it, and if they access it from their own Google uh, account, they're going to get this. They're going to be able to see it in view-only mode, and in view-only mode, they can file, make a copy, as long as they're logged into Google at this point. So they can make a copy of this template and then edit it and adjust it to use it to whatever extent they want. By the way, another interesting idea would be put a page or a sheet in there with instructions so they get the instructions. The same thing with a Google document. Again, from a Google document, here's my templates that I made. So here's a Google document, a template for a resume. May set that up so it shares, so get you know, they, they can view, anybody on the internet can view it. And then anybody, again, who's logged into their Google account, this is what they're gonna see. They're going to see this and they have to request edit access, but they don't need to do that. They can, because it's a template, do file, make a copy, and then they can edit it however they want to fit their needs. So again, this idea of creating a template in docs, sheets, drawings, slides, et cetera, et cetera, it, then all you have to do is create it in such a way, set it for sharing so anybody on the internet can access it, and then give them some instructions about how to make their own copy so they can edit it and make it fit their needs. I'm Teddy Burris, your Google Workspace and Gmail strategist, trainer, and coach, and I hope these ideas are useful for you.